Hey guys, so I went to Burlington today and this is one of the items that I picked up. This 13 by 9 inch glass bake set. Um, I said recently I wanted to buy one of these because I wanted another um, baking dish that had a top that comes with it. So that when I do um, bake mac and cheese or banana pudding, I don't have to kind of do one or the other so that I have the right type of... Um, dish to put it in or you know for once i put it in the refrigerator to store it i like to have something that has a top on it this one was 5.99 over here i picked up this well now tea it says hibiscus orange peel ginseng rosehip apple and linden it says it's supposed to be the energy version and it's 25 tea bags i like hibiscus um in drinks so i'm hoping i'll like this uh it's caffeine free and let's see, what was the price? $2.99. Over here, I picked up this one by the brand Tea Now. It's Berry Hibiscus Green Tea Infusion 25 Tea Bags again. And it was $2.99. Over here, I picked this up for my older son. It is the Skinny Serbs Ice Cream Collection. And it is in the flavor of birthday cake. I thought he might want to mix this in with like his unsweetened almond milk or something like that. Just to add a little sweetness without a bunch of carbs and stuff. So here is the nutrition label if you are wondering. And that is the price. And this is uh, a little recipe here. And then some ideas of what you can add your mix to. So yeah. Then I picked up this um, Hardy Naturals Raw Organic Moringa Powder. It is 8 ounces and it was $4.99. Bam. And I will be putting this in my smoothies. And I will just hold this here really quickly. So in case you want to pause the video to read about what this is. And what it does and all that good stuff and there you go as well as the nutrition label over here at least the part you can see that's not under the price tag then up here i picked up this um 60 veggie capsules it's the maca um superfoods and it was 5.99 so again there you go in case you want to read about what it is all that good stuff and then over here i picked up the moringa one in the capsules as well and it is 5.99 and there you go all righty then over here i picked up this bag i think it, it's really cute and this is going to be for my little son and this is for him to take on his band trip to disney world his band is performing in festival disney in march of 2019 so i figured this would be a good little bag for him to take to keep on his back for when he's going through the parks you know with all his friends and everything so I like that it has a zipper pocket here that the rope straps are actually um, really thick for this type of bag. And then it also has a zipper here on the side that goes into a pocket, which is still separate from the inside. So if he wants to put his phone maybe here so he can push it inwards versus just having it right exactly on the back, he can do that. And yeah. That's just what that looks like on the back. It's just simply plain. Yeah, and it has plenty of room in it. So I like that. At first, I thought that this zipper was just to go into the main part of the bag until I opened it. And I realized it actually doesn't. It's its own separate compartment. So that's pretty cool. And this was $12.99. And then over here, I picked up this jumbo storage bin with cutout handles 14 by 11 in the color white and it was $4.99 so it's great for storing clothing cosmetic toys and so I picked it up for the second option cosmetics to put um like eyeshadow palettes and things like that because my container is overfloweth already just from the things that I purchased during the Christmas clearance. So I just want to have a place to store it until I either use it or give it away. And that's just what the basket 
looks like. Then over here, my only two beauty items, I picked up this Essie nail polish. It was $3.99. Um, the tag is super faded, so I had to bring, they only had two left in the whole store this one in this light blue color that i really didn't want so i brought that one up so that the woman could scan it and make her life as easy as possible um does it have a color i'm not really sure it just says 11:29. oh wait is this it up here let's see here oh it's legend okay so that's cool that is one of my niece's names the youngest baby girl all right, and then over here, I just picked up this Burt's Bees Flavored Crystals Lip Balm. It says, taste the burst of crystallized raspberry juice. Um, I didn't know Burt's Bees had... I didn't know Burt's Bees had anything like this. But, uh, yeah, hopefully it's pretty good. And it was $1.99. I've been seeing Burt's Bees all day at different stores, so... I was like, I'm finally going to go ahead and just get one. But I didn't see anyone like this that said flavored crystals. So hopefully, like I said, I like it. Next, I picked up some jewelry items. So I picked up this watch and it has like a leather type band with these pearls in it, which I thought was really cute. And then it just has like roses, it looks like, on the dial. And this is the box that it came in. It is by Rock Aware. And it was on clearance for $9.99. And the reason I picked this up, I'll show you, is to go with something I already had. I try not to buy stuff just to buy. I try to buy things to go with things I already have just because I know that I'm really good about keeping my stuff for long periods of time. I literally have a leather coat that I purchased when I was pregnant with my youngest son who will be 16 this year and the coat is in excellent condition and I still wear it in uh the winter time so yeah so I have this Steve Madden bag and as you see it has the pearls that goes through it just like on the watch so I thought that would be really good paired with that I got this from TJ Maxx a while ago for $34.99 so yeah i thought that would be cute to go with that and then also i have these um boots that i wore in the winter time and uh they just have the pearls as well to go across the front so i thought that that would be cute they're dirty because i wore them in a parade uh that i marched in with my younger son's band so disregard <laughs> then i picked up this by sparkle sparkle and allure uh, this size uh, seven ring. I had to size up. I wear a size six on my ring finger, but I noticed with different brands, you know, you just do what you got to do. I just thought it was really pretty. I don't typically buy um, costume jewelry and things like that because I'd rather just buy the real deal because you can get it for so much more affordably than people think, but it was $7.99. Um, then also by that brand i picked up i'm sorry no this is a different brand the the rest of most of the rest of the stuff is by these other two brands so this is amelia designs and it's just a bangle and it's in a rose gold and then that is what the stones look like there and it was $7.99 then by bcbg i picked up this rose gold tone bracelet here and it just has a cross and it says, what, does it say something? Yeah, it says, have faith. And then this one is $6.99. And then from this brand here, I picked up this ring. And this one is in a gold tone color. I had to get this one in a size 8. And this one is $5.99. And then also in the rose gold, I picked up this set. It has just the earrings and the matching necklace. I figured this would be something cute to wear out on the weekend when I'm going out to dance or whatever. And I don't want to necessarily worry about what I have on in case I'm going in the area I'm not familiar with. So that way if someone wants it, here you go, sir, take it. $7.99. Then I picked up this one also in that brand. It's just a little bracelet. Also in the rose gold tone. And it was $7.99 as well. Then I picked up this ring, and as you see, this one, 
I have in a seven, whereas this one I had to get in an eight. And that is what this one looks like here. And this one was $5.99. And then to go with it, I just picked up this set again in the white gold tone color. And it was $7.99 as well. All right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed all of my little items that I picked up today. And I will see you all in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not and to like, share, and comment, and all that other good stuff. Until next time, I hope you guys are doing great, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.